We'll look at how a large machine shop retrofitted a 1988 bellows gear shaper and how reevaluating their conversational program has increased productivity. The company uses a 1988 Fellows Gear Shaper with a GE Fanic controller to produce five different parts. The machine cuts out parts by moving a die up and down while the part rotates around, making three passes to fully cut out the part. The 1988 Fellows Gear Shaper had been running non-stop since the 80s, but recently had developed some erratic behaviors. The FANIC controller would randomly quit and an alarm would go off. The operator would then need to wiggle wires and kick the controller. Sometimes this worked for a while, but eventually the machine would shut down. Mock Motion was able to offer the retrofit at half the price of other retrofit solutions, as well as being able to duplicate their interface and software. Mock Motion built a new cabinet and software. They replaced and installed both the old controller and wiring, as well as recreated the conversational program to be identical to what they had before. Mock Motion's highly trained service technicians came on site for a week to test, train, and tweak the new retrofit. Not only was the 1988 Fellows Gear Shaper machine restored to its original condition, but Mach Motion's technicians were able to improve on the machine's production and performance. We hope this brings a better understanding of a typical retrofit story. Please subscribe to receive notifications for new videos and articles.